Thank you for considering Auto Repair Boss and welcome to the Auto Repair Boss demo tutorial. The Auto Repair Boss program is highly customizable and can be set up to fit the unique needs of your business. In this tutorial, we will be previewing some of its many features. We suggest that you work through each of the tutorial sections as they will give you an idea of what the program can do. After you complete the tutorial, feel free to experiment with the program further. In this video, we will be discussing how to prepare an estimate for a customer already in the database. This video also includes using the tire lookup feature. So let's get started. To prepare an estimate for a customer already in the database, select Point of Sale from the Auto Repair Boss main menu. There are several ways to search for an existing customer. You can enter the customer's last name in the last name field and press the enter key. A pop-up browse window listing all customers will be displayed and the first customer with that last name will be highlighted. Use the arrow keys to scroll through the list of names until you reach the desired customer. Alternatively, you can type part of the customer's last name, such as the first letter. Press enter and the highlight bar will automatically move to that section of customers. Once you have the desired customer highlighted, press enter again and the program will fill in for you all of the customer's information onto the adding an estimate record screen. You can also use the F6 search function, which allows you to search for a customer by last name, home phone, work phone, license plate, or vehicle identification number. Use the arrow keys to select the method of search and press enter. A pop-up browse window will be displayed with the desired information. Use the arrow keys or mouse pointer to highlight the customer or vehicle, press enter, and the program will fill in for you all of the customer's information onto the adding an estimate record screen. For our example, we are going to search for the existing customer Otis Baldwin. Type the last name Baldwin into the last name field and press enter. A pop-up browse window will be displayed with Otis Baldwin highlighted. Press enter again and the customer's information will be placed onto the estimate. Mr. Baldwin says he needs new tires for his 1989 Chevrolet Caprice. We have worked on this vehicle before, so the auto information has been previously entered. The cursor has already moved to the auto section of the estimate, so simply press F6 and the Select Auto Record screen will be displayed. Select the 1989 Chevrolet Caprice, press enter, and the vehicle information will be added to the estimate. The cursor will now be in the part number field. Occasionally, you might have a part number that has a variety of subpart numbers. For example, if you sell tires, you know that there are different types of a particular tire. Mr. Baldwin's Caprice needs 15-inch tires, so we're going to search for all 15-inch tires we carry at our shop. Press F6 and the part number search screen will be displayed. This function allows you to perform a search for a part or service by a variety of different methods. We want to search by tire lookup code, so select F5 by tire lookup code. Highlight 15 and press enter to make your selection. A list of part numbers will be displayed for you to choose from. Select a part number by using the arrow keys or mouse pointer to highlight it and press enter. The selected part number and its information will now appear on the estimate. Press enter three times to complete the line item and you will notice that a list of parts and services have been automatically added to the estimate. This is because when the tire was added to the inventory, it was linked to the kit code we set up for tires, and this kit code includes the common parts and services associated with the installation of tires. Both the link function and the kit code are key features of the Auto Repair Boss program and are explained in further detail in a later video. At this point, we are finished writing Mr. Baldwin's estimate. Mr. Baldwin says he would like to come back tomorrow to have the job done, so press F5 to save the estimate. The program will ask if you want to print an estimate or work order. Mr. Baldwin would like a copy, so press the estimate button and the estimate will be printed. This concludes our tutorial on how to prepare an estimate for a customer already in the database.
Please work through the other tutorials to further familiarize yourself with the features and capabilities of the Auto Repair Boss program.